Hey guys, James here today, and welcome back to The Sims 4 Dine Out Rags to Riches. Oh, we have a lot of money. Uh, totally forgot we had a lot of money. So, uh, we have this spare room upstairs. That there's been quite a few suggestions of what we could do with it. Also, I feel like we should probably, before I do anything else, get some more lights at the back half of this room, because it's quite dark there. Also, maybe a light in this room, too. Uh... And I don't know. So anyway, so there was a couple of suggestions. Uh, one of them was that we could do a secondary chef station up the top so that there was a chef up the top and one down the bottom. Not a bad idea. I just don't, I don't know how the game would deal with that. I feel like it wouldn't do what we would expect it to do. Also, that floor is not correct. I feel like it wouldn't do what we'd expect it to do. Like you'd expect the top one to serve these tables and the bottom one to serve these tables. But I feel like that wouldn't happen and this one would end up serving like that and it would probably get messy and I feel like just having them in the same spot would be better. Like we'd probably just end up getting a second one in here. Uh, we'll probably push their house back a little bit just to make the kitchen a bit bigger. Um, the other suggestion which I quite liked was to do a bar. Uh, because you can have bars in your restaurant and they can serve drinks and then all that kind of stuff. And I think that's not a bad idea. I don't actually know how they function properly. Like I, Because I know I have seen, you know... I don't know if we have to hire a mixologist individually. I don't really know how it works, to be honest. I'm going to remove that wall. I might even make this room a little bit smaller. Just so we can uh, use this space. That floor is not even going the right way. Use that space as a bar and see how we go. Really, I just want to, We'll just try it out. We'll see how we go. Uh, so we have a bunch of different options. We could do a full-size bar, which would be perfect. Because then it would like, you know, have a perfect bar area there. And it'd be, and then you could have like all these little uh, sort of tables out here as well, which would be quite nice. But we'd have to figure out how to get stairs there. Because uh, we need to get behind. So we'd probably have to shift around the bathrooms and it'd become a whole thing. I mean, it's possible. Uh, we could have a door on the outside of the garden to so walk through the garden to get over there. I don't know. That's also possible. Not the most elegant solution, but it's definitely something we could do. Um, I do like that bar. It's probably This is probably my favorite bar just because of the uh, the huge sort of, you know, taps on it. There's a few other ones that have it too, but eh, it's not as nice as these ones. Um, I do very much like the idea of a bar, so I think maybe if we do that. Uh, then I would like to get stairs in there. Would be the most elegant solution. So if we have a look where they are there, if we get, I guess we can do it. We just have to shift everything this way a little bit. So if we, uh, let me just do really just, nope, oh, hang on, hang on. So if we shift, hang on, Sh Jesus, there we go. <laughs> hang on. Okay. You could have shifted the door for me too. Thanks, Sam. What is going on? Why can nothing be placed here? There we go. <sighs> Need to move objects on. All right, you go there. Then we move all of this, like this, there we go. So this bathroom becomes a little bit smaller. Gives us a bit of room here for some stairs. Uh, then, the stairs, so the stairs have to go... Oops, hang on. The problem, the only problem with this is I don't really know where the entrance to the stairwell would be. Like, I, like so yeah, all well and good. We have space, we have a spot for the stairs, but how do our staff get there? Hmm. That's uh, not something that's been considered. Uh, I will also, I'm going to move this stuff back now. So I'm going to make their apartment smaller because it, for God's sake, it's making me real mad. Oh, don't get me angry. You won't like me when I'm angry. <laughs> uh, there we go. Good. All right. That'll go there. Uh, <laughs> so that will make the kitchen bigger. Then a way we could do it is if we could somehow sneak a hallway through here and it would get over there and... But then that bathroom's kind of in the way, and then I think this just becomes more trouble than it's worth, really. Like, I mean, sure, we could just do a door on the outside, but that's that's hardly efficient. You have to go there just to get behind the bar. Uh, the original, you know, method of just putting a door there probably would have been the best idea, uh, now that we think back to it. But, you know, it's worth a shot. So let's see, where, where are the bar backings? They are here. So we have one here, we have that one, or we have this one. I do like this one, obviously, especially because it's blue. It's quite, it's, yeah, it's quite nice. I mean, at the end of the day, this is kind of a breakfast restaurant. Uh, and people suggested that the, uh, do like a, the wave bar, isn't it? The, the, I wish you could do the coffee bar, like the, uh, the barista bar, uh, which people suggested, but I'm pretty sure you can't do that because it's not, uh, it's not a cafe lot, but anyway. I just did that wall there so it wasn't a weird shape or anything. Now, the other problem is if we're going to have stairs there, <laughs> they can't go there anyway. They'd have to move forward. And at the end of the day, these stairs are just going to come up and come around here anyway. You can't... You'd have to have a door... I'm just going to undo everything. 
just let's go back to where we were. <laughs> let's go back to where we were. Uh, let's just use a door. Because that's gonna... A door. I'm gonna use a door. You got a door, you got a gym. Remember that ad? That was a good ad. We're gonna get a door in. A door. Uh, then... I'll just have the bar backing here. Because it's just... The absolute simplest way. <laughs> like, I mean, it, it's a little inelegant. That you have to walk outside and come around. But you know what? It works, and I think that's that's the real beauty of it. That it's something that works. It, it's not... Eh, well, eh, oh well. Uh, that's what we're going to do for now. So let's go... Ooh, decorations. Stat was it statues? I think it was. I somehow found them like perfectly last time. Miscellaneous, actually, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, it's quite far away, though. I liked it being here, but then we have a, a, a use, un, a, an unusable space just at the back. Like, it makes sense having it, like, there, so you'd have, like, a nice little spot. But then, I don't know what that space is, but anyway. I like it like that. I like it like that. Alright, so let's go... Not that. Daytime. Let's get the, uh, the fence from this side, because we should probably have a similar setup over here. Okay, you've just unpainted all of me wall. Which, by the way, we probably need to repaint at some point anyway, so that's not really a big deal. Uh... Let's just do that. Good. And uh, I definitely want to get these columns in. I definitely want a roof above it. Don't know how the roof is going to look. Uh, so let's go there and there and one in the middle. That'll be fine. What happens if we bring this roof all the way out? Huh, it's not bad. It's not bad at all, actually. Uh, and then we could do even like a little uh, pathway through this. That you'd walk on. Which hopefully they will actually walk on and not not walk on, because that would just be rude. Um, so we get these out here. I want to just do it like that, just so it's a little bit even. I When we get another harvest, I think we'll plant a couple of more, just so we can get them in. Um, okay, so that looks a little bit more like a building, which is quite nice. Uh, the bricks are still awful. Uh, we could probably just change them to a nicer brick at this point, one that isn't, you know, filthy. Maybe get, like, some of this sort of get-together stuff. Uh, I don't know. Do they have... They have brick ones, but I don't know if I want to... Uh, Use that, do I? Well, maybe I do. Could use like some of these. What what other colors do we have? I could do like the uh, I could do like this. What does this look like? I don't know if I want the whole building in it, but maybe part of it. Like at least maybe the ground floor and then the upper floor. We do something different. Okay, why is it only doing one at a time? Oh, because those are all the bathrooms. So it was only doing one bathroom at a time, which is kind of stupid. But anyway, so if we did that, which was quite expensive, and then the second floor we could do like. Uh, Again, like it needs, it needs to have like the white wood trim, so at least that matches. Ew, <laughs> ew, <laughs> that's just gross. No, well we can't do that. It have to it has to be the same sort of either the same style of brick or it needs to be hmm, one of these, which I don't think is going to look good. No, it looks kind of gross. It, it really, really looks gross. Uh, you know what? Let's go back. Oh, hang on. Keep that one there, and there. Okay, so we're back to this point. Uh, maybe we'll do... Uh, is that just like a... It's kind of a, just a modern brick looking thing. See, I like, I like those bricks, but I don't like that it has the, the base on it. Uh, <laughs> so that brick is just this brick, right? Which I guess it's not a bad one. Let me do that brick. I don't think I really want the whole building to be brick anyway, to be honest. I think maybe, what if we just go plain wall here, and then like this middle section could be brick, because why not? Give it a little bit of an oomph. And then have that as this again. This sort of main structure bit here, maybe. So like this whole middle bit. Probably want to do some windows on the side there as well. We'll figure that out in a minute. Um, get that as that as well. Oh, actually, I might want the second floor is... No, no, no. We'll go, we'll go like this. So we'll go like this. We'll have the brick in the middle there. Uh, there. Then we'll grab the brick again. Maybe the back calf could be brick. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see, we'll see how we go. I don't know if that's too much brick, though. We'll see. So it'd be like that. So you'd have... Oh, I guess that as well. So you'd have it sort of looking like that. I don't know. if It looks a little plain on the side. Well, that's why we need windows, I think is to make it not look completely blank. Uh, let's have a look. Maybe like these windows, or I guess probably the same windows we were doing on the other half. Uh, but they don't fit in particularly well. We can do these ones. 
Uh, I guess the bottom floor can't happen. The top floor will. Maybe the bottom floor we can do some more landscaping around the side or something. Because uh, just the way we've designed the bottom floor, like if we put a window there and there, it's not going to work. Uh, so what we might do instead, if we go into here. Nope. How about these? Nope. Those are huge. I wish I was like these, but not quite as big. Um, Because it'd be nice to have like little trees lining the side, but all the trees are colossal. <laughs> yep. Case, point in case, right there. Absolutely colossal tree. Uh, I want, yeah, I want like these, but like miniature versions. And I don't think they really exist. Like, I mean, we have, uh, we have, you know, like hedges and that, but it's not really what I'm after. What happens if I scale this up? It definitely works, but I don't want to do that. It looks kind of ridiculous. Uh, see, I want like a, a tree like this, like that big that you can go, do, 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 do. Just little ones, just little trees. Maybe I can do these, I don't know. Maybe if we get three of these, what does that look like? Is that in the right spot? No, that doesn't look right. Hang on, what have I done here? Have I done this wrong? One, one, no, that's right. What have I done here? Oh, hang on. Wait. It's just the middle tree that's wrong, but then, hang on. Oh no, I see what the problem is. It just needs to go there. Wait, no it doesn't. Wait, that's even spe- Is there something wrong with this? What have I done? So we go one, two, one, two, one. Yeah, hang on. Well, should I have done- Oh, this tree's wrong. Uh, that should be there. That should be there. Wait. Oh my god. Why is this so- <laughs> Why is this so confusing? No, this tree is definitely wrong. That tree should be there. There we go. I don't know if I even like that, to be honest, but that's just the way it is. I guess we don't really need this weird... I don't even know why we have this around anymore. We don't need this weird sort of lining of concrete everywhere. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. All the way down the back. There we go. I don't know. We'll put them there for now. I don't know if I like them. I don't know if I hate them. But they're there, so that's just the way it is. That's just the way the cookie crumbles. Then I might get some more of these just around the side. Uh, like, just there, maybe, because those windows are too big really for anything else. Oh, see, we don't have matching windows on this side though, which I guess we probably need. So we go, what, there, and then we get one of these in. Hang on, I thought it was like a perfect, oh, because we had a door there. You go out a door, you go out a gym. So there was a door on the other side right there, so I think I'll just overlay a couple of hedges. Just so it's the same size. Uh, good. Alright, so I mean, it looks more like a structure now. It's getting more structure-like. Uh, a little bit more interesting anyway. So that's good. Uh, right, inside, we got a bar. We got a bar, we got a gym. No, wait, we don't have a gym. Never mind. Uh, what chairs don't I have in here? I don't have a green one in this room. And I don't have... Ooh, which chair do I have? I ha don't have this one, I don't think. Wait. No, nope, I do. It's that one there. There's four chairs. I think I'm missing this one. Yep, that's the one I was missing. This one is also missing, that one. Okay. So they're all four seaters now. None of those rooms are actually decorated at all, but edited at all, as I like to say. But that's okay. Um, Do we have... We don't have, like, colorful matching chairs, do we? We could use these, but... Ugh. I think, I think we'll just leave the, the bar like that. I don't know really how it works, to be honest, but it's all right. Well, it's night time. Oh, I didn't, I, yeah, because I, I know we undid everything, so we didn't actually complete the kitchen expansion, as in the uh, the, the actual restaurant kitchen, which we want to do. I don't know why, why did I do that? I could have just done this. What did I just sell? Oh, buy. No, I sold something. I guess these walls maybe are cheaper. Uh, all right, so we're going to get another one of these. It's going to go right there. No, it's not, because I have no money. I've spent all my money doing other stuff. Delete delete those. Oh, still can't afford it. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Sell the hedges. We don't need them. How much is it? Three, three hundred. Ugh. Ugh. Can I set the damn tree? There we go. Oh, these are really cheap. Never mind. I'll leave those. Um, What about the window? Damn it. Alright, well, we'll just put everything back. <laughs> what else did I just do? Oh, there we go. I don't know. I can't tell what's changing. Oh, the thing's upstairs, right. No, put those back. Okay, put those back. Uh, do we have... 
money in? Not really. We have some household funds. Not enough to uh, really do much with it. We'll take twelve fifty. Uh, what about from? Hang on, swap from grass. We could probably take a thousand. That would allow us to buy another one, which is quite nice. So we'll get that in. So we get two of those in there. We have a few, uh, you know, waiter stations up the top, which is good. We have one down the bottom, which should be fine because we don't have that many tables. Um, okay, so then what I want to do is go back to live mode. Uh, we want to go to the restaurant. We're going to go mark up 300%. Let's just try it. I don't know how well we'll go with that, but we'll try it anyway. Uh, we're going to go to our staff. We're going to hire another chef. <sighs> You're all terrible. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. All right, maybe I'll hire another waiter first. Probably a good idea. You look pretty good. So you're in. Uh, you're fine. Did it refresh my chefs at all? I don't want to hire... A... I'm pretty sure you are my kleptomaniac guy anyway, so I don't want you. Uh, my other chef can be Candace, I guess, because it really doesn't matter who I hire in this situation, because you're all terrible. Anyway, so we have a full lot of staff. We've upped the, you know, the, the price markup of the restaurant. The ingredient quality is still standard. Let's see if we can get away with it. Uh, <laughs> see if we can make a profit. We'll see how we go. Obviously, we're not going to go today because, you know, it's nighttime now, but uh, let's see how we go. All right, so you are going to go sleep. You're not tired, but you know what? I just want you both to go to sleep and shut up. Shut up about your sad little lives. Uh, that door is locked. Is that door locked? Uh, allow access to employees. Uh, locked door for everyone but household. And then we're going to go allow access to employees. Uh, as well, just so they can get through there. Uh, someone was mentioning, mentioning it like, oh, there's no way for uh, the gardener to get to the, the garden because there's no door there. But I mean, they just go through that door and up through this door and then they're out to the garden. Um, which needs a bunch of watering too. It's Friday night, so I don't know if they're actually going to be here soon. But anyway, whatever. Uh, do we have any bills that I got to pay? Because I got to work, work, work every day? No, we're good. Uh, you're already awake? All right. Well, I mean, if you're awake, you might as well earn us some more money by painting then. Um, should probably reconfigure this space as well because it's kind of stupid. Just at least do that. There we go. Uh, go listen to music and then just go do a classic large painting. There you go. And I guess I might get you to clean that up at some point. Also, you should probably get them to just upgrade everything here. Uh, and yeah, you guys are suggesting that I should just use the sort of handyman services as well because we have free services, which we've had for a long time. So that's not a bad idea. We could just call in a repairman. And uh, just get that stuff done really uh, for free. Hey, a masterpiece. Nice. All right, sell that. Yep, cool. Now I'm going to get you to... Can you go mop that up? No, or not. Never mind. Don't go do that. Can you go upgrade these at all? Upgrade. Superior flush. We'll work our way through here. And then you are having a shower, so that's good. I'll wait till you're done. Handiness level four. Nice. Um... I'm pretty sure that allows us to order upgrade parts, which is good. I think that's what it said. Okay, you're already going to the toilet by yourself, which is good. I'm going to get you to then move on to the next toilet. Nope, not self-cleaning. Superior flush, just because I'll break less often. Yep, and I'm going to get you to mop that up. Then I think we... Oh, hang on, we have spoiled food, which is actually... Oh, stop opening it. Which is actually not anything, but I'll get you to do that. So you're still doing that, which is good. I'm going to open up... This restaurant, I guess. Oh, hang on, let me check the staff. Actually, I didn't look at the mood. Everyone is neutrally happy. So we're going to open up. Also going to open up grass, which is still only four and a half, but whatever. That's fine. Okay, so you're cleaning up. I need you to go and... Uh, yeah, yeah, it hasn't started to lose money. It's fine. Serve breakfast. Uh, do some pancakes. You're still working on that. So we're going to go two times speed. Not going to go too fast here. We don't want to overload ourselves. Uh, we'll have to train up my new chef as well and make sure that they're doing all the cooking carefully, but we'll get that done soon. So you're all done with that. So I'm going to get you to go... Well, how, what do we have in business ones? Not a lot of money, but that's okay. So I'm going to go transfer, you know, 3,000 because now we have a lot of money. So let's put that in there. Going to get you to train up the new staff. Uh, pay for training. Uh, brief. Uh, I'm also going to request your cooking speed to be carefully because you're pretty crap at your job. Pay for training. Uh, I'm going to go brief training on you as well. There you go. Uh, I'm going to go pay, manage, pay for training, standard. Oh, actually, hang on. Did you have a better... Do you have the top tier training available? I didn't actually read that properly. Yeah, you did. Do extensive training. There you go. 
Okay. And manage. Pay for training. Brief. Manage. Pay for training. Standard. And then obviously I'll train up my hostess as well in just a moment. So I'll make sure everyone's getting the training that they deserve. Did I train up my chef? I don't actually... Yeah, I did. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to get you. Manage. Pay for training. Standard. Okay, so that should... I think that's everyone we paid for training now. Hopefully. We're going over here and we're doing stuff. We're talking to her. There we go. Oh, yeah, good. Um, hang on, aren't you... Wait. Are you my hostess? Yeah, you are. How come you're not... Well, you were in your uniform a second ago. Oh, well. Anyway. Uh, management, uh, welcome. They're not sitting down. Okay, can you... What, did you eat? Yeah, you did. Cool. I'm going to get... No, wait. What did you eat? You didn't even finish the pancakes. I think you ate some... I think you had a bowl of cereal or something. That's just rude. Oh, because he can't cook at the moment because there's no... He doesn't have his own stove. Yeah, right. Okay, fair enough. Um, well, go have another cereal or something and then go do an abstract large painting. I don't know. I'm back over to you. Uh, let's go. Management, uh, we want to recommend a dish, obviously, because we're not a bunch of idiots. Oh, look how expensive this stuff is now. So good. 115 from that. Uh, so we definitely welcome these guys. Yes, we did. Anyone upstairs yet? No one's upstairs, so that's okay. I'm wondering if we need to... Quest specific mixologist. If we need a mixologist to do stuff. I don't know. Oh, there's the kleptomaniac. Actually, I think he's already stolen something because there's no menu on that table and there definitely used to be. So I'm pretty sure he already stole that. <laughs> Welcome. Um, hang on. More choices. Uh, mean... Is there a way to... I think... Didn't you guys say there was a way to, like, accuse him of stuff? Friendly? I don't know. I don't think it would be friendly, but whatever. So we'll welcome those guys in. Hello. Uh, so we've got plenty of wait stuff now. So hopefully people... This, because I think last time we did this, we didn't actually manage to get everyone through the restaurant properly. There you go. Hang, wait, hang on. Everyone's in... Are you in pajamas? Oh, these are, like, normal clothes. Oh, no. Maybe they're pajamas. Yeah, no, okay. Some, I don't know, it just looked like everyone was kind of in average clothing. Um, anyone upstairs? No one's upstairs yet, so that's fine. We'll just keep an eye on everyone downstairs. Uh, so I think we've welcomed, I don't think we've welcomed these guys because they haven't been seated yet, but we're going to go welcome them while we're here. Uh, there we go. Hey, what's up? All right, so you can go and go to the toilet. Uh, oh, hang on. Pee like a champ, because you are feeling like a champ, of course. Uh, so their food is on the way, which is very nice. Hello. Blip. I'm going to go uh, management check on the table. Make sure they're all doing okay, of course. We're going to make sure everyone's happy. Did my gardener ever come? I don't know what time they arrive. Slash if they're actually still a service of ours that we have. Uh, <laughs> slash if that's something they still do. Make sure their table's okay. Good. And then what I'm going to do... Just to make sure that we do still have that garden, not hire a service. Uh, let's have a look. So, hire a service. Uh, it's already scheduled. Okay, well, maybe we should cancel it at some point. Okay, stop that. Don't look at your phone. Let's go over to these guys, because they have their food. Check on table. Oh, we haven't... I thought I welcomed them. Check on table. There we go. So, it's 10 a.m. Been open a few hours, so it's not too bad. So it's welcome them, make sure they feel like a, you know, part of the family, part of the uh, the restaurant family. Check on that table there as well. Uh, I think we could probably do with some advertising uh, here to get some more, whoops, to get some more people in. Maybe we should even turn up the lot number of people that we can have, because I think we're probably reaching the maximum number of sims that can be in the area. That's probably why we're not getting a huge amount of people in like we used to. We used to get a crazy number of people, which, yes, because we had 40, maximum of 40, which is kind of insane, but anyway. Let's go recommend a dish. Uh, obviously, the uh, pre-work shot slash the pancakes because they're the most expensive. Uh, there you go. So we are making a much nicer, much healthier profit this time around. And then, of course, I will welcome them. Uh, you now need to go have... Uh, I'm going to let the restaurant run itself for a little bit. I'm going to go have a quick meal, have some cereal because we can't actually prepare any food right now. You are going to go sell that to a collector. Uh, 
Let everything just take care of itself. It seems to be all okay. You're coming downstairs. That's good. You're off to the toilet. No problems. Uh, looks like everything is running pretty smoothly. We've been open six hours, which is not too shabby. Grass has also made a couple of grand. Not bad. We are, we are, I think everything is finally starting to snowball a little bit, I think. I think we're really, really getting somewhere. I also just want to get these salt and pepper shakers on all my tables now, to be honest. Uh, and I know they're facing different angles. Don't worry. Uh, no, it's part of the charm. It's really, really part of the charm. Get that menu back on that table because I really should be one there. I feel like that's kind of in the way, though, that one. That one feels like it's not in the way. Uh, anyway, let's go upstairs. We'll get the same sort of thing up here. Right there. Oop. And because these rooms upstairs, unfortunately, don't have as much decoration as the ones downstairs. But that's okay. Uh, there you go. One there. But we can at least afford to do these little things on all the tables. Oh, except for that one there, which I didn't do. <laughs> uh, and there we go. And a little bit there. There you go. Okay, so now they all have that on the table. So there's at least a little bit of decoration everywhere. Okay, so we'll leave these both open for eight hours and then we'll continue on from there. So you need some social, which is fine. I thought you might want to just chat to her while she's there because she's just inside. You could just, uh, you know, friendly, uh, banter with old friend. Because you can chat while she's eating. Should be okay. I think I'll go disallow new customers after this group. Uh, do you want to just go like cloud gaze or something? Because that's, eh, again, probably the easiest way to get stuff done. Just go do a little bit of cloud gazing. You're in a pretty good mood. Just need some fun. That's fine. All right. So you guys are off to cloud gaze. Just going outside there. That's fine. Oh, wow. We had a lot of people come in. I guess it's the runch, the runch time. Yeah, it's the runch time lush, as I like to call it. I'm not quite sure why you guys are so angry. I mean... Ah, oh, because they're not that friendly. I guess we need to train you up a little bit, which is fair enough. But uh, we'll come by in just a moment and hopefully make you feel a little bit better. I'm going to go over here and make sure they feel welcomed. There you go. I'm going to make sure everyone feels welcomed as well. Management, uh, welcome. I'm going to get you to go welcome them. And then I'm going to get you to obviously recommend a dish, which is going to be the usual recommendation. There you go. Do that one there. Anyone upstairs? There are people upstairs. Uh, looks like... Did you... Oh, whoops. Did you guys actually get your food? I feel like we're still waiting for your food to, to come out. Check on their table as well. So you guys are going to both be doing things. Oh, hang on. You're not going to recommend a dish because she's not sitting down. Can you take your seat, please, ma'am? Thanks. Ma'am? I can't recommend a dish if you don't take your seat. Dance? Okay, you can go dance. Uh, you guys, I think, yeah, we already spoke to you, didn't we? Yeah, you guys are fine. Uh, I can't recommend a dish now, because you don't want one anymore, but that's fine. Management, uh, I'm going to prioritize their food, maybe, because I feel like they've been here for ages. I don't know if they're going to get their food, but we'll find out. He's coming up that staircase, nice! Uh, did I not do this? Check on table, I thought I clicked that. There you go. Alright, let's see how those guys are doing. Your food is on its way, I promise, maybe, I don't know. We'll see how it is. Oh, this guy's... I didn't even notice those people in here. Hello. Sorry. Let me go welcome them. Because I feel like... Uh, what's going on here? Are you giving them food or are you taking orders? What's going on? I, I honestly don't even know. Uh, no, not MC. I keep clicking on MC Command Center. It's an accident every time. Check on table. Management, check on table. Uh, so it's been nine hours. Let's go to grass. Let's close up. So we earned 1800 bucks because we had to pay like 1500 wage, which is fair enough. But it did pretty well. You guys are done and you're leaving, so let's not try to chase them down the street this time. Because I remember last time we chased them across the street and, you know, I was like, wait, come back. I want to know how your experience was. You guys are also not sitting at your table for some reason, which just seems quite rude, actually. You guys are still not getting your food, so I feel like you're never going to get your food at this point. Uh... Which is a bit unfortunate. I can't wait till they actually fix the bugs in this game because it'll make it so much better. Um, I don't know what you're doing here because we have disallowed new customers. So I'm actually just going to close the restaurant because everyone is just being rude. We did make $400 though, so we're making a pretty healthy profit, although it is bugging out half of the time, which is a little bit upsetting, but that's okay. Everything seems to be working uh, somewhat, which is good. Oh, she's painting autonomously. Nice. Do you want to go resume those? Because that'll be quite good. Hang on. Don't eat chips, because he's about to make some actual good food. Can you clean up and uh, go sell that to a collector? Because that's beautiful. Absolutely fantastic painting. But it could definitely be better. Uh, like, you could have, you definitely could have made a better one. So let's try that. Um, but yeah, we made, a, we made a healthy profit. 
He's leveled up in cooking as well. We were sort of working on upgrading the toilet. But I think that's quite good. I think I'm going to leave this one here. I know we kind of yeah, just did a little bit more of the grind. We did a little bit of renovating. It looks more like a, you know, a complete structure. I mean, it's pretty impressive when you think about it. Like, this is what we've made from nothing. Like, we, we moved here a few episodes ago. We built this up uh, from nothing, no money at all. I mean, most of it comes from our blackberries slash paintings. But at the same time, if it didn't come from those, we would, you know, probably still be on an empty plot on the first restaurant. Uh, but I'm pretty proud of this. I'm pretty proud of this because we are really starting to turn actual decent profits on both of these. Let's check our snooze staff, make sure that they're all kind of okay still. Everyone's still, you know, happy a little bit. <laughs> yeah, you need to come back from training and be better. Everyone else is not too bad. Like, everyone else is pretty average. You're awful. But you'll get better with time. Actually, hang on. Are you... Candace Bacon, are you sisters with Nora Bacon? I think they... Yeah, look at that. You can, especially because they're in the same spot. You can see, you can definitely see the family resemblance in their face. Like, they looks very similar. Yeah, that's nice. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. But I'll see you next time. And have an awesome day.